Warren Suckman's podcast before stage two of the Joe Martin Space Race. We're in the South Side of Fayetteville, Arkansas. Typical staging area here in the Walmart parking lot. You got the big uh, 109 mile race today. Yep. So uh, we got in with Eric Martin. New team, Thailand. Yeah, no, it's going to be good. Yeah, well, first tell me a little bit about your transition to your new team. The, the Thailand's man beats up the team big time. You're a big part of it. Uh, we moved to the new team, yeah, unfortunately Jameis uh, kind of came to an end, but they continued on sponsoring with uh, Silver, um, so we kind of saw that it was going to happen and I wanted to stay with Kyle uh, Murphy, who you know, won the San Dimas time trial, and was fourth yesterday, absolutely, right, so, um, you know, Hilti, Hilton Clark, the director here, he, um, Reached out to us early, or early in the mid-season, and I wanted to. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to be a part of something that was still um, growing and and help develop all these kids. I know, obviously, like I've been involved in that. So yeah, yeah, that's like, but someone did job done. Done well, and but you need to just somebody to kind of guide you as you get better and better. You know, like position to do well. Works with your work schedule. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty lucky. Like the patient base that I draw in there is all active lifestyle, and they allow me to, you know, kind of get my training done in the morning. And then for the most part, I see patients till about six o'clock. And then some days I'll off for some mornings because not everybody knows with their schedule. So since I've opened my own practice, it's been so much easier for me. Um, Training to the level that I need to be competitive at, and then as I dial back at the racing, then I need to spend more time in the community. So, yeah, absolutely. So, tell me a little bit about this race now today. Uh, longer uh, road races, more stays together than tomorrow. Tell me a good finish for you then. Yeah, I feel like the rest of these days are really good for our team, not just myself. There's a couple other guys that can do well. Orlando, you might see him coming up. So, I mean, I can't tell how the wind's going. You know, it's uh, unfortunately when you race the same races every year, like these ones, guys tend to race the same way. Although the way that the GC is panned out today, there may be a little bit more action out on the road and. You know, we have you know quite a few guys within a minute as well. So if things hit the fan, then maybe we're in a good position to move, move some guys up as well. Uh, as far as the finish, though, uh, you know, I kind of feel like it could be a little bit better because it's a little bit more attrition. There was like a there was a few lulls with those little punches, and then it would just go single file, and then you were where you were. This one might have a little bit more for somebody who's got some legs at the end of 110 miles. So. Yeah, I mean, it, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, you know, it's good to have fun, and I, I kind of wish it was a little bit more windy like it was when we got here on Wednesday. That would have been really nice. Yeah. That was a very different wind. No, I have very a lot of yeah, I mean, that makes you have to race your bike, and that's always where I've always done good on uh, in the races is when everybody actually has to ride. So, yeah, anyway. Yeah. All right. Cool. Good luck. Have fun. Thanks, Pete. Nice Thanks, man. Thank you.